everyone, my name is Kay Kalkoff and welcome to a Stamping to Share video. Today I want to share with you a birthday card and it's made with the stamp set called Silhouettes and Script. It's one of our hostess sets and I thought even though it's the first day of December, you know, we don't want to forget about those December birthdays. I myself have a January birthday and I always appreciated it when I got a present that wasn't associated with Christmas. So be sure that your birthday cards in December and January are always um, non-Christmas oriented. So here we go, we have party hats and, and lots of sun, and when you open it up it says have a sunny day with lots of hip hip hoorays on the left side. So let's go ahead and I'll show you how to create this card. The first thing that you're going to need is some bright and sunny paper. This is Daffodil Delight and it's cut at 4 and 1 fourth by 11 inches and scored at 5 and a half. So now all I do is I just fold it along the score line and I give it a nice little press. And then the next layer is a layer of Blackberry Bliss, one of our 2014-16 in colors. This is cut at 4 by 5 and 1 fourth, and we're just going to take a little bit of multi-purpose liquid glue and glue this directly onto the front panel of our card, just like so. And then the next layer is a piece of Bermuda Bay, but we're not going to work with that just yet. But if you'd like to get a cut, it's 3 and 3 fourths by 5 inches. And then the layer we're going to put over the top of that, which we're going to do some stamping on, is 3 and a half by 4 and 3 fourths. You'll notice that I'm just cutting everything 1 fourth inch smaller as we layer up on this card. And so let's go ahead and do some stamping with this white panel. I'm going to bring my stamping mat into the picture because the Dottie Angles stamp set that we're using. So let me show you the stamp sets that we're going to be using. This is Dottie Angles and you'll want to use a block I with it because they're pretty large photopolymer stamps. And then of course this is our hostess set which you can purchase as a hostess. So if you're a hostess with Stampin' Up! and Celebration is coming up, so I know that many of you will be, um, be sure to keep this set in mind. It has a $17 value but as a hostess you can purchase it for $10. Alright, so let's go ahead and stamp this. We're going to need a little piece of scrap here and this is just a piece of text weight paper. Now I have my the dotty part of the dotty angle stamp set and I'm just going to ink that up with some Daffodil Delight. We're going to stamp this twice so the first time is going to be a little bit lower and then the second time I'm going to stamp it a little bit higher but we're just going to have lots of dots here coming down into our panel. So the next thing is our little hat, and so we're just going to stamp this hat right here, and then we're going to go ahead and stamp a few more all the way across this card. And another one here. And then we're going to add our birthday sentiment in Blackberry Bliss, and so we're just going to stamp that right underneath these hats. And of course some of these will, will fall off the edge of the page, but that's okay. And right here. And we're done with that part. And so now all we need to do is attach this panel to our Bermuda Bay panel. Again, that's 3 and 3 fourths by 5 inches. And so we're going to do that with some snail. We're just going to cover all four sides and then just center this right here. And now we're going to add a piece of striped grosgrain ribbon. This is in Bermuda Bay. And what you want to do is you just want to take the end of it and you want to put it into kind of a, a once over knot like this. And then when you get it looking like you want it to look, and this looks pretty good because you want it to lay fairly flat, you can go ahead and just take a, rib, a ribbon scissors and you'll just cut this end off here, cut this off here, and then we'll just tape this around on our card. Okay, here's my taped around ribbon. You can see the tape on the back and here's what the front looks like. And I think it's so cute, it's such a quick and easy card to do. Now for the inside panel, we are again going to use some Whisper White paper, but this is cut a little bit bigger than our front panel of Whisper White. This is 4 by 5 and 1 fourth. And again, we're going to get our 
scrap paper out and we are going to stamp the hat on the side our hip hip hooray and we're just going to angle that up just like so and then we're going to stamp our sentiment have a sunny day right over here and there it is and then we can just go ahead and put this right into the inside panel of our card with a little bit of snail. I like using snail with Whisper White because then I can be assured that the glue will not show through. And then for this panel, we're going to glue this on with multi-purpose liquid glue. And it goes right onto the center of that Blackberry Bliss panel. And there it is, our card is complete. It looks so cute, it's such a nice, cheerful, birthday card. So here's the one that I just completed and here is the one that I started with. Hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. Have a great day. Thank you so much for stopping by Stamping to Share. If you need a Stampin' Up! demonstrator, please visit my blog at www.stampingtoshare.com. Bye-bye.